I think Apple screwed their customers. I want to know what you guys think. Righto, tell you there, champs. And if you don't know, around what, what, three months ago, they released the new MacBook Pros with the, you know, six core parts and the RX 560X. This is a brand new product, okay? So brand new product just come out a few months ago and now they're coming out with Vega Graphic. 60% faster they're supposed to be in graphics. That is really bad that you just buy a laptop and then like a few months later it's out of date. I mean, we all understand. Sometimes you might mistime something. You might buy a Galaxy or an iPhone, you know, a month before the new model comes out. Well, that's bad luck, right? That's just bad timing. But when you buy a brand new product, you do not expect it to be out of date within a few months. I think even the OnePlus is like six months. With Apple, it's like three months, four months. It's out of date. With new models coming out with graphics, that's 66% faster. That's friggin' crazy. And imagine you need that graphical power. So you sell the model you just bought a couple of months ago, then you take the hit, and then you buy this new one with the new graphics, and then early next year, they come out with eight core MacBook Pros. Imagine that. I wanna know what you guys think. Did Apple screw their customers? To be fair, they could not have told you that, you know, Vega graphics were coming out in a few months time because there would have been NDAs. They cannot announce it before AMD do. They probably wanted to put those Vega graphics in from the start but they had to wait for AMD. But people spent some serious money on these things, these MacBook Pros. And to be out of date within a few months, and myself, I'm lucky, you know, I've got an XPS 15, but I did buy a MacBook Pro 15 as well. And I got screwed. It's out of date. Now, some people were able to return them. <laughs> <clears throat> but some people weren't. I'm hoping Apple will do the right things for people that want to return for store credit or return to, you know, buy the new one. I hope they sort of sort them out, sort out some sort of deal with them if they bought, you know, the fastest graphics and they need the graphics. You know, they've only bought these things a couple of months ago and that was a new product at the time. I mean, Vega graphics in these MacBook Pros is a really big deal. And Apple had an event, what was it? October 31st and no mention of it. Now I think they never mentioned it at the keynote because they didn't want to bring attention to it because people would have been pissed. Imagine they announced that the MacBook Pro is now coming with Vega, 66% faster graphics. To me that wouldn't have been a big announcement. But in a blog post they just wrote a couple of lines, yeah, coming out with Vega graphics. <laughs> like it's no big deal. 66%, <laughs> no big deal. And when I made the video about Macs coming out with that, I got a few comments from people really annoyed that they just spent on a top of the line model and now they're out of date. It's just, yeah, that's that's crazy. Like, especially for Apple. Apple don't update their hardware very often. So you think when a new product comes out, you're safe. They're probably not going to update it for at least a year. Could be friggin' three years. Maybe they should have waited until Vega was ready. But um, yeah, who am I to argue with what they do with their own business? Anyway, let me know what you guys think. Are you happy with what you got now? Let me know in the comments. I'd like to thank you guys for watching. And until next time, guys, tally ho.